Hello. Today I thought that I would show you how to download some mods folder and how to install mods. The first, the first thing that you need is a WinRAR program that you can download here. I will link it in the description. So you just click this button and it will come down here and you press it so the installation will start. And once you're done installing WinRAR, it should look something like this. The second thing you need is a mods folder. I have uploaded mine so that you can just download it and put in your game. So you press download. Here. And... Uh, it comes here. I have downloaded two. <laughs> I open this up. This is why you need WinRAR so that you can open this folder. And you will put it on your desktop. Now you don't need this. And now you go um, to your Sims 3 files, documents, electronic arts, Sims 3. And here's all your game folders you take your mods folder and drag it into here it should be here i think you can open it up check what's inside it's probably empty <laughs> so now you should uh, install some mods i've actually done a little handy dandy website my own that I have all my favorite CC creators. You can visit Ifka Sims. Here we have some pretty hairs. Let's say I want to download this one. Press download. Now it's down there, you can always do this. Now it's in your uh, empty the filler, we call it in Swedish. <laughs> now you're gonna open your mods holder, open packages, and you can put it in here. I usually organize my package folder. So you could have one folder for hair, you could have one folder for objects, like furniture, you can have one for clothes, and you can have one for game mods, like you speed up time or some lightning mods, like that, so that you have it a little more um, clean. And then you put this in the hair folder. So now you go here and here and here, and it's kind of organized, that's always nice. <laughs> and when you download, you can see the difference in uh, package files, because they have like a white box here, like a little paper. I have downloaded SAPE, and that makes it so that, can, that I can open these files and check thumbnail and like that. So that's why I have a green little thing there. But if you download, um, let's say, a Sims, a Sims 3 file, they look like this. They should go in your electronic arts, Sims 3, they go in your downloads folder. So that when you open your launcher, they go here. So that you just check mark everyone and then you press install so that you know that you have two different files that you can download either they are sims3 files then they go here or they are package files and then they go here and i think that's it if you have any questions you can ask them in the comments thank you